But uh, before we go, we wanted to give you a little bit of a parting shot because I know that with a lot of the things that we've done here, it can seem as if, oh, well, that's inaccessible. That NMAP stuff, the, the, the security research stuff, that's only available to people who know exactly what they're doing. Not really so much. <laughs> you can have absolutely no idea what you're doing. Yeah. Hey, uh, Alex, let's go what ahead and make the deal What happens when there. it goes wrong? Yeah, this you is up sad, sad days. Um, so yeah, so it, was, it was covered under warranty every time, which was the best part. <laughs> yeah, totally. yeah. I mean, you know, one thing I got to say for Chrysler is they stand behind their product. Hey, they are. That's for sure. So, yeah, every time that we, we would mess up, this happened twice, that if you mess up flashing the V850, <laughs> then the head unit just doesn't work anymore. Um, and so the first time what happened was I was flashing it, and, like, you can't, like, there's no, like, output that is going on. So it was flashing. I didn't know what it was doing, and I was like, I was like, fuck this, I just turned it off. <laughs> it was like half flashed, wow. it never came back on again. Wow. Don't do I was that. The audio from the um, and the, like, the real upgrade mechanism doesn't let you do that. It has yeah. safety. I have no safety. I was driving was my seatbelt off. Yeah. <laughs> so then, yeah, again, I take it to That's the fun. dealer, and uh, you know, they're like, what happened? I was like, I was like yeah, the, the, the like, screen doesn't come on anymore. <laughs> so you remember last year, I don't know if, if you came to our talk last year, we had, showed this video where we were trying to get the. Uh, automatic collision prevention system to engage so we could capture the packets. And the way, oops, the way we did that was, sorry, I gave away the secret there. The way we did that is we got some cardboard boxes out and we drove into them hoping they would stop us. And that didn't work. It didn't work. So, like afterwards, after the talk, everyone kept coming up. You idiots, like it only works on metal. Yeah. It's like, oh, so this year Let's we're like. Let's get ourselves some metal. Yeah. So here is the side view footage. It got a little bit loud. And oh. once again, the collision prevention system did not work. This is out front of his kid's school, by the way. Yeah, doing having metal did not make any difference at didn't all. Didn't make any difference. So if you're gonna get metal, don't try it. We tested, doesn't work. Save right. yourself a so. couple hundred bucks. So, <laughs> folks, if you're gonna do this kind of work, you're gonna make mistakes, and it's totally okay. Okay, this this is how you build up your skills. Yeah, it's, uh, I think they said, too, somebody was watching from across the parking lot. Right. Like, what, what the heck is doing? going on? Why are they running into trash cans? There, there's actually a clip, because they had the camera set up on a tripod, and people were coming by, like, staring at the camera. What? Like, I've never seen a camera before. What is that? <laughs> um, oh, my I think goodness. the uh, the best part of that whole presentation, too, is, like, as they're, they're going through the presentation, yeah. you see how much research they really put into that. And that was that was a lot of work because all you ever hear is the headlines of guys hack into car, you know, and you imagine just like a dude on a hoodie right. in front of a keyboard for a little while. But it was like they put in a lot of time doing the research and then they ran into some, to and, some and a lot of error. Trash cans. And that's yeah. that's the greatest part. I love that. That is the hacker ethos, which yeah. is I'm just gonna keep throwing stuff against this and at yeah. some point maybe I'll have a Eureka moment.